Occasionally you'll reel in and find that, the, that your hook link has tangled around the top of the tail rubber. It's less likely to happen if you're using lead core, but the way to get rid of it when using your normal main line tied all the way through to your quick lock swivel is to put a bit of sinking rig tubing or the new covert tungsten tubing onto the main line just above the, the, the lead clip. The extra diameter means that you're less likely to get tangles and you just cut it to the length slightly longer than the rig you intend to use. First off, simply thread your main line down through the tubing. Next, put your tail rubber on as before and your lead clip and tie it onto your flexi your quick lock swivel like you did on the original setup. As with the first time, make sure that the lead clip clicks firmly onto the size 8 quick lock swivel. Then your tail rubber goes on and then insert the tubing into the end of your tail rubber to keep it in place. And there you have it. When the lead's attached you'll be able to cast that rig out with clear conscience and the knowledge that there's no chance that the rig has tangled. Even though our sinking rig tubing is very dense and lays flat on the bottom, sometimes you might want the extra security of knowing that the end of the rig tubing is pinned very tight to the lake bed. For this, simply get some critical mass putty, warm it slightly between the fingers to soften it and make it more sticky, and mould it around the top of the tubing. This very dense tungsten putty will add weight to your setup and ensure that the end of the tubing lays flush to the lake bed so it will be less conspicuous to carp feeding around the area of your terminal tackle.